package, which is a slime shop, if you didn't know. And so, here's what it looks like. And, this is what they came with. So first, there's this little cute, told me what I got, which is honey bread, rose milk, tea bingsu, li and leaky flesh. They also gave me a little care guide with um, some Sour Patch Kids. Now, this is the first layer. I think this is a DIY clay slime. And this one's Leaky Fluff, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah. And then this is the Bing Su one. So I'm going to start with Leaky Fluff. This is what it looks like. So excited. Oh, it smells like lychees, but I've never smelled lychees before, so I don't know what that smells like. It's accurate. So, oh, it's actually not that sticky. It's a thick, fluffy white slime. I like the smell. Um, I wish it was like stretchier. Otherwise, it's really good. It's really thick. It's kind of sticky, actually. Actually, but if you're like only sensitive. It smells like wheat cheese. It's really good. We'll come back to that later. It kind of inflated already. I like how Roma Slimes fills their slimes different. Okay, now we're gonna have Rose Milk Tea Bingsu, which is a Bingsu slime. And um, so, this is what it looks like. So, this is a Bingsu bead slime right here. And here's its cover. It has a little charms and this little topper thing. So let's play with this slime first. Wow. Whoa. Ugh. Oh my god. Yeah, I'll just fix that. Sorry guys. Wow. It smells like like spoiled milk to be honest. Or maybe it smells like flowery milk. But anyways, it kind of hurts your hands, but otherwise it's really good, really crunchy, and I really like it. So, I'll just put that there. Here's a little clear slime container. So, let's take it out. It's kind of hard to take out of this kind of thing. The container kind of broke, but that's okay. It's this clear little slime. I'm gonna put this here. Let's take out the charms. So here we have this little flower thing. Then we have this little boba, boba charm. And some sprinkles. Just have that. This can't go in there. So I'm just going to take this out. It's mine. To be honest, I thought this was going to be a snow fist slime, but I guess it's a pink subi slime. But it created this really light pink color. Like, really light pink that you might not even notice because I it was such a small amount. It smells like rose milk. It kind of hurts my hands, though. This slime's so good. 
don't know how I'm going to fit that in there, but we'll check on that later. And the last one is the one that I'm really excited about. It's my DIY clay slime. It's so cool. So here's the little clay piece. And this is some little other slime that you attach to it. This is the main base. It's just some little whipped cream. Oh, by the way, Max, I mixed two slimes together into this thing. Um, so, so this is supposed to smell like honey, I guess. Yeah, that does not smell like honey. It's a super thick and glossy. Wow, this is really thick. And super glossy. goodbye to this slime. Maybe if there's a way I can just keep a little bit. I'm going to remove this much. Yep. And I'm going to put this in here. Time to assemble the slime. So first, I have not ever had a DIY clay slime, but so here's the clay piece. It's this little clay sculpture. I'm going to lay that there. That's what it looks like. And I'm gonna add this now, this little clay piece, which is whipped cream. And now I'm gonna add this clear slime. How do I open this? Yeah. It has the same kind of texture as that pink one. Okay. Hold on. Okay. And here are some honeycomb femos. There we go. Oh my gosh! Look at this! I love DIY clay slimes now. It's really pretty. Oh gosh. This clay is so fluffy. Look at this. Look at the difference in the textures. Just mix it. Yeah, Sorry for the background mm -hmm. noise, guys. You have to go through your activities. <laughs> it's really satisfying. It's. I think it's gonna turn into a clay slime, definitely, but maybe like a less fluffy one because I don't know because. <laughs> This is a really good slime. It doesn't smell like honey though. Hmm. It smells like, I don't know what it smells like. It actually smells like the other slime. It's really satisfying to play with. And I don't think it fits. So that's okay. And this is really good. Okay, that's the end of my Momo Slimes review. Overall, I think really great slimes. Definitely recommend. It's just that um, don't come for the scents because I don't think they do very well in that kind of thing. But in texture, it's really nice. So recommend mobile slimes and thank you for watching but goodbye